Hi everyone, today I am going to show you how to create an event on Facebook. Um, a social media presence is very important when you're telling about your brand and who you are. It can also be very important when planning events. You can spread the word very quickly and supply your invitees with all the information in one great spot. So for Facebook, I pulled up the main page of my Facebook. This is what comes up when I log in. On the far left, you'll see a spot that says events. You're going to click on events. As you can see in the center area, you have any upcoming events. To the right, you can find events in your area today, tomorrow, this week, anything like that. But we are going to go to the left side where it says create event and go ahead and click on that. You have a choice between a private or public event, depending on your guests and the event type and all of that. I'm going to go ahead and choose private event. When you click on that, you get this window that pops up. There are recommended themes that you can choose from, or if you look right up here, you can actually choose a photo of your own. I went ahead and picked out a photo that I wanted to use for this. So I'm going to use this silly little monkey. As you can see, you can actually reposition the photo, which is kind of cool to make sure you get the aspect that you want. Below that, you'll enter an event name. I'm gonna go ahead and add one. It's a sustainability party. Then as far as location, just go ahead and put in the address. I'm gonna put in my work address. And once you choose that, next you'll go to date and time. So you can choose here your date, your time. You can actually add an end time. Um, so we're gonna party from 9 p.m. till midnight. Description tells people a little more about your event. Um, you can say, bring your own food. You can put in um, you know, paragraphs of info or just a few words, completely up to you. If you scroll down farther, you'll see a spot guests can invite friends. If that's checkmarked, that means anyone you invite can additionally invite other people. If you don't want additional people invited, go ahead and uncheck that. And then the second one is show guest list. So I'm gonna keep that checked so that my guests can see who else will be coming to the event. Once you click the create private event, Facebook will think for just a minute and then it will pop up. You will see it here, all of your information. Now at this point, you can scroll down, you can click invite and choose friends. You can scroll through all of your friends. Um, you can click all friends and it'll alphabetize them. Pick whoever you want by clicking on the little dots and click send invites. Now at this point, for general information for events, you can actually go up to events and you'll see your event listed there as an upcoming event. You can also go to your calendar and see under hosting and your event will be there also. So you have easy access to your event at all times. So once again, once your event's created, if you log back into your Facebook another day and you're not quite sure where to go, you will click under events on the left and it will take you right to your upcoming event. I hope this helps everyone out with creating events on Facebook. It can be a lot of fun. It can help spread the word about your event very quickly. Have a great night.